Hey guys, in today's video, we're going to recap the last five years of this juice business, JK Juices. Now, too, we are about to open our storefront. So it starts here at the farmer's market before the truck when we just made juice at the local popcorn shop in their overflow kitchen. And the story kind of goes on from there. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Comment below when you started watching, when you subscribed, when you joined this journey. Um, I want to know. I want to see your comments. Many of you guys I feel like I know so personally as you have commented for so many years. So we're about to start a new journey and um, I can't wait to share it with you guys. While also forming relationships within the community, JK Juices is sourced with local organic farmers produce and that's really important to us. I just bought a food truck. But it's not really a food truck. It's an ice cream truck and it's perfect. Look at it. That's my dad driving it. It's official! I'm feeling excited. Look, here it is again. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Look at my dad drive how cute it is! Ah! It's totally the one, I tell you what. After six months of shopping for a food truck, there it is, and I just knew it! I'm just so excited! All right, she's filling up. You guys want the grand tour? Here she is! These are all just little stickers that I'm gonna remove. She's a short little guy. She's so cute, I just can't even handle it. I found my flooring. I'm gonna buy it. It's in the very back though, so this could be a little bit of a crawl. Mm -hmm. I think so. We're just gonna go. So grab that electrical torque and take it underneath and out. Alright, let's take it another few inches. Alright. Good tour of it, but this is a three bay. This is a produce wash sink. Uh, this is the really big unit that has shelving. There's another shelf that goes right there. Uh, tons of counter space. Um, a hand wash sink. The refrigerator is down there. Lots of counter space. Here's the juicer. But things are going super well and we're just very happy because it's such a great feeling to be able to serve. Look at our cups. Aren't those cute? I'll set up the camera and do a little montage of everything. Okie dokie, very last Saturday at the farmer's market. And then the juice truck will be put into storage. Can you guys even see me? I have a new place today. There's not as many people. We're usually, I'll show you guys. We're usually over here on the other side of that curb. And the rest of the market is over here. But today we're around the corner. I'll show you. Well, we're having some problems. The generator isn't starting. But we're making use of our time by spending money instead of making money. Oh, I'm gonna vlog you guys for memory yeah. purposes. <laughs> Kevin got Show a classic. Holly got a strong green. So She's being bold. Oh, dude, ooh, they look what? so cool. Look this. This is great. So fun. Oh. One, two, three. Welcome to the JK Juice Vlog. Watch us make things. We're back in Findlay. We got a strawberry rhubarb juice. It's pretty good. It's not too sweet, it's not too strong, it's right in the middle. If you love rhubarb, it's delicious. Being in the paper and doing another big launch, so you guys wanna say hi? Yeah? Twice a week, truck brings joy and juice to Finley. That's just so cute. I'm gonna make sure it's today. Yes, this is a life. This is really comfortable. Mm 
today. This is kind of a more unique video. It's not relevant to all of you, but I wanted to show it. We got a new juicer for the juice truck. Long, but skinny, which is really good. We're limited on space and more food trucks, so um, this is like perfect for our countertop. Oh, juice truck intro song! <laughs> By date. Uh, what's the one? On, is that the strong beat? Of We've got our plants and we got our juice. Okay, bird. Ooh, I almost killed that bird. <laughs> There's a house that has like a clay pig outside that looks like a dog, you know, life size. And the dog, their their real dog, is always like sitting in front of it, looking at it, expecting it to come alive. <laughs> <laughs> what? No, I'm just waiting for you to do something weird. <laughs> Can I buy a juice right now? I'm like, sorry, sir, we're driving and we're sold we out. Drive. You guys don't know. You guys don't know what we're about to do. Do you know you what we're about to do? in one of your videos. I did wink in one of my videos, but nobody picked up on the wink, so. It's about to get real. If you guys saw the wink. For the first time ever, one of you guys came to the juice truck. Uh, it's just, it was so crazy. I don't even know how to explain it. Look at the color of these. They're like... They're, they're like unicorn mermaid. <laughs> it's not a real thing. <laughs> they're unicorn mermaid. <laughs> uh, is that like a com like a hybrid? Yes. <laughs> a unicorn and a mermaid. Good morning. Did you start here? Yeah, out of yes. the farmer's market? Yes. Yeah. 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 Hi! Yeah. We know, we said yeah. she has a trip shirt, she has a trip shirt on. on. Are you from this area? Seems as though we have a faulty generator. Officially, it might be broken. These generators were. Oh, we're ready to go. <laughs> we're a little late, but that's okay. Ooh. A little bit of rain. There was a, like a special weather statement at like six. Six a.m. <laughs> Just standing here in the lobby for five minutes. It's a Saturday, guys. Ready? So we arrived, we made it, we're set up, and now we need to juice first. We're doing our ginger shots, which is ginger. And ginger shots. So we've got a fan favorite that still has greens. We've got a nice fruity one that is super hydrating. And then we're going to use shots on more. Guys, we have a huge announcement. Um, we're in a space that we've never shown you before. Guys, this is our storefront. This is our 
juicery storefront that we're gonna be renovating over the next opening a storefront. So it's completely different than a food truck in the sense of like a food truck is so simple. Pretty much all you're doing is the equipment and how you're making it and storing it. Like that's it. You don't have to do structural and electrical. You don't have to, and you know what it comes down to? Nobody is walking inside your food truck. Um, you're serving from it. Is that what it is? What? It's fine. Our, our tiny, yay, how cute. Aww. This is a tiny art league here in town that hides art around the city. Guys, look, they actually made us two. We're just gonna capture all the firsts. First time we got mail. Do you want to reenact that scene? Not really, but we got mail, guys. <laughs> Our little tiny basket. Here we are confirming which lights we want on dimmers. Oh, the whole different language they were speaking. <laughs> we got those ones. We're like. <laughs> 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 grease trap. Which is Even though we don't have grease. grease. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of stuff happening, lots of things coming together. They were all very impressed with the SketchUps. We do like our SketchUp, it helps us visualize things. Got the hookups. I'm just curious. We still got a lot of painting to do, so we're almost done, so we're almost done in the front. And then. We still have to do all of this. Grandma brought Granola. goodies. Granola. <laughs> Is that baklava? First piece of equipment. Oh, second piece, actually. So, look. It'll turn into one piece. Yeah. And it'll this will kind of hang from here. That's what I was going to say. It's going to hang. <clears throat> till yep. we put the little supportive blocks. Yep. We missed one. We missed one somewhere. She got it! Okay, now we're ready. One, two, three. It's smaller than I thought it would be. Really? That's about the exact size I thought it was. Because it's a, you know, a little bit more all-in-one. So whether you're a juice truck, whether you're a storefront, we're gonna be using this in our storefront. It can produce a good enough amount to hopefully sustain um, our needs. And there they are. Did it. This is called delivery day of all the things. Wowzers. All right, we're gonna quickly move this back into its place. So we're gonna carry it back into place. There they are. Check. Check. We're gonna be back early tomorrow morning. He is supposed to come sometime in the morning tomorrow. I'm gonna assume around like 9 30, 10. We'll continue this video tomorrow and hopefully, fingers crossed, we pass. I just really wanted to go over the last five years and kind of look back on some of the fun moments. Uh, it's been kind of fun to look back on. So comment down below when you started watching and um, subscribed and be sure to subscribe if you're not already. You know, it kind of feels like we're just getting started even though we just recapped five years. It totally feels like this is just the beginning, uh, which is always a good feeling. The next video is a start to finish of the storefront reno and to where it is now. And we'll do one final walkthrough kind of officially revealing the storefront to you guys. And then if you're interested in the kitchen aspect of it all, I'm going to do a like cold press juicery commercial kitchen tour to kind of give you guys an idea of what we have in ours and what you may want in yours if you are building one out. If you're a new viewer and don't know, I do have an ebook on how to start a juice truck. You know, a lot of you guys have purchased it and it's been really helpful in many juicery startups. So whether you're doing a juice truck or a storefront, the ebook is helpful for any new juicery um, and it's always linked below so be sure to check that out if you haven't already over the last five years of doing this I get lots of comments and questions and emails regarding business aspect of it all so I wrote a book um, that's really straight to the point be sure to check it out if you're in the juice business or thinking about starting in it hope you guys enjoyed this video it was a fun one to make and to look back on 
Um, definitely lots of memories and like silly moments. I was laughing through this whole video. So the next one will be an overview of the reno, which is just another kind of silly thing of us renovating the storefront into what it is today. So stay tuned to that and stay tuned then to our announcements of our grand opening and all those fun things. All right. I'll see you guys later. Bye.